Hey guys, <clears throat> there we go. It's Kim, of course, and I am on, I'm kind of going to mix up, see how it goes, but I'm behind on my haul videos. Don't worry, you thought I was just crafting and not, yeah, no, I got stuff. So I went back to Dollar Tree. This is going to have, sorry, thrift store, one thing from Michaels and Dollar Tree. Got more of these collapsible. I just, for my trailer and stuff, got three of them more. Perfect. And I thought these were cute for Happy Mail or something on a, in a mini album. Hello Summer. <clears throat> and they're paper, I believe. Popcorn bags. Five by inches by three and one quarter. Maybe get eight. <laughs> you probably saw that without me looking. Let's see, are they paper? Emma and I like to have popcorn, but I don't think we need to. I got these more for gifts, gifting in. And they're kind of a waxy paper, I guess. Which makes sense for popcorn. So I got those. <clears throat> got another one of these because if you have Ikea or Michael's rolling cart three, these fit perfect. Got right here goes over the railing. Has to be on the side. <clears throat> but yeah. So another one of those. That's in the 4th of July section. And I just had to have this. They have all kinds of cute ones. I picked the bee thermometer. I might get another one. I want a new one for here and I should get one for the trailer. So found these. I thought these were interesting. So that'll go in my vintage Tim Holtz bin. Look at that. Very cool. Got this. I've been looking. This only had the one and I decided to just go with this. I can cover it if I want, but I'm going to put the bee gnome the hanging one here. So there's that. I saw it on TikTok or Pinterest or somewhere. Somebody did that. So super cute. I was kind of picky about breakfast. <laughs> and I think I'm going to have her come. <clears throat> her mom, hopefully that works out, drop her off on Friday. We're leaving on Friday. And then if she needs breakfast, I'm ready. I know. Not a good breakfast, but she's pretty picky. I have never bought these and always tempted, and I thought, you know, these would be good for putting pop in, if you have people over, garbage can. So I got the red and the blue. These are so cute. I had to have them. And then I thought to bring along for the girls if they want to take a bath together. Can you tell I'm excited? Cute. These are called Blizzard Dust Scented Bath Bombs. And this one's Royal Bouquet scented that bomb. So. I spray this when I go to bed, and I don't know, maybe it's mental, but I swear it helps me sleep. So it's this Wizard Naturals Aromatherapy Soothing Lavenders. There you go. <clears throat> Let's see. Oh, these are super cute makeup brush holders. So it's in the makeup section. Check these out. Oh my gosh. I got more than these, but I put them in my, I'm going to gift people stuff. So here's these. I don't, I'm not one to commit to like, a, I don't know, what is it where you scrap each other or <clears throat> sign up for an exchange. I just, I can't depend on my time. And like right now I'm super busy with the, with the parties. So anyway. Or party. I got this super glue. I'm gonna try. I like the look of this bottle, so I thought I would try it. It says glue saver nozzle. So I'm thinking I might glue down the spinning thing a thing because it's pretty precarious. Let's see. What else did I get at Dollar Tree? Just for the girls, Tori. Her mama does such cute things with her hair. Today it's a mini bow. I'm like in bun. And the good thing, I thought this was good for the car. I'm going to put together a whole thing for Emma in the car because it's like a five-hour drive. So she's older. I mean, she'll be fine. But okay, I think that's, oh, let's 
just all going to just go. I ended up getting this one. It was like 50% off and then another 20 I don't know. It was cheap. It was under $7, I think. And this is one of their craftsmith that they brought out. No, I do not need it. We all know that. But I kept thinking about it and thought, oh, well, it's on its cheap whatevers. I'll do it. So I did. You've probably all seen it. It's not double-sided. Pretty, pretty. I'll show, do a video of the banner and things separate. Because this will go too long. Isn't that gorgeous? Look at this. Oh my gosh. Just so pretty. Love that. That's cool. So there wasn't anything in here so far that I've seen that I go, ooh, that would never, I like it all. So then they have the coordinating, you know, cart, plain cardstock, which is cool. Look at that. Gorgeous. Ooh, foiled. Very nice. So yeah, I decided pff, I'm going for it. So there you go. I did. <clears throat> okay, I think we have time for a thrift store. I went to th like three different thrifts. I went to my doctor. I haven't seen her in a long time. And it was near a town that, I don't know, and they had a value village in a more affluent area. Oh my gosh. They it, One, you couldn't find parking, which kind of surprised me. And two, the prices were even higher than most places. So, But at my local, these were 49 cents. For the girls. What are these called? Cats and pickles. Oh. oh, it's got pickle. Okay, I get it. And they look to be in good condition, and I just thought that'd be something fun for them to play with. I think I'll give this one to Miss Vienna since she's kind of not getting much. <laughs> With her sister's birthday, I got this the other day at a different value village. I like this. It's not vintage, but it's vintage looking, and it has teals and yellows for a good tiered tray. So it's $3.99, and then I got $30 off of that. So $2.80. Look at the top. Am I showing? Washburn Crosby Co. Minneapolis. So just for fun. Yesterday's, I did find a few things. Their books were ridiculously priced. Oh my God. Anyway, I got another one of these, and they always have an electric place, you know, plug in, and it works. Because when the girls are over, we need three of these. So, and that way I'm not hauling it up from upstairs. So I'll have three lamps like this. $5.99. So I thought that was good. That was doable. <clears throat> and I had 30 off of that. Yesterday was Tuesday, right? Then I got at my local one, the Snow White, mainly for the pictures, for scrapbooking. Craft or get that. Too cute. Ooh, scary. So look at that front cover picture. Oh my gosh. Look at the little bird. So cute. Disney Snow White. I don't remember. I think it was like 99 cents or something. And I tried to buy some of these. I thought I bought more. Oh, yeah. Here's all my books. Wait, let's me do the stamps. I'm so all over the place. Got this one yesterday. thought that was cool. And again, I got 30 off. I don't know. It doesn't say who this is by. Hmm. It has all the nice words on it. Affection. Heartfelt. Sweet. So all kinds of little words. Now you could stamp this out and cut these apart or use it as a backdrop. So there you go. <clears throat> Isn't that the cutest little box? Mary. Ingo Brecht. I just love her stuff. That was cute. So I grabbed that at my local for 49 cents. Got this at the local. I'm going to for Emma to use and Tori when she's here. 
That's cool. So, there's that. Oh, Dollar Tree. <laughs> just scrubbed my head. <laughs> I don't know. This is a shampoo brush. I don't know. That might hurt. <laughs> just say. Oh, and at Dollar Tree, I just wanted the pull. She goes, you know, there's another piece. I go, I know. But I'd seen, you know, that big planter that I used to spin and put brushes in. People put posts in the middle for outside. But I thought maybe I could do this a pole. So this is the toilet plunger handle. So we'll see if I ever do it. But it's also good for windows or whatever, locking them. Okay, I'm going on too long. Let's see. I got another one. Oh, here's why I bought this one. It was $7.99, but I got $30 off. So I have two things in here I like. This one. Not pretty. Cute. But who's this by? Inka Dinka Do. Brand new. So hopefully I use it and give it some love. But this is why. And I don't think I have this one, but oh my gosh, is that the cutest house mouse? Again, brand new. Kitty Snuggle. Stamp of Roses. So this is back a long time ago when they were making them. Sorry. The other ones, I'm like, this is like the top view of a snowman. Kind of cute. Sylvia U Rubber Soul. Kind of a cute sun, be cute on the card. So they were all good, but I bought it for those other two. This is Dream Denami Design. That's cool. So yeah, got those. <sighs> Amazon, I ordered, I cannot find mine. And these, they say kids love them too. I got, used to get them at um, Dollar Tree. And the reason I like this one is for the one color. I know, I'm so weird. Skin tone. And I like the... T so it's oil pastels, but that's the perfect skin color. Yeah. So there you go. But look at all the pretty colors you get. And you can use your watercolors with this. Water, you know, add water to it. Like a paint. Okay. Then last but not least, I think it's last, but you know how I go... I think this is it. Disney. So this is for Emma. It's a lead reading level. I want some books in the car. And she could definitely read this. And then I get the pictures when she's done. And then I found older, overly priced, but I liked them, so I got them. Because one of these days I'm going to do a junk journals with these golden books. Buy four, get one free, but I got the 30 off, so they came out. Raggedy Ann and Andy. Now, I've never... I had a Raggedy Ann growing up. I don't know when that says. 1979. It's really old. That's when I graduated from high school. So I liked the pictures. So I got that one. I got the three little kittens. I used to love this story. This looks older because it's kind of yellowed. Oh, 1979. <laughs> that doesn't seem that old, does it? I don't know what 50s on you. Anyway. Okay. But yeah. The three little kittens who lost their mittens. I want to read this to the girls because I just think this is such a sweet, sweet story. It's got those vintage pictures. Cute. So I got that one. The Three Bears. This is probably really vintage too. That is so funny. But I guess that is considered vintage. Let's see. <laughs> it says 1970. Oh. Renewed 1976. Okay. Cute. Can't be that old because it's got Sesame Street and stuff on the back, right? I mean, they weren't around in the 40s, or I never thought of that till I was looking at it just now. 
Well, that's a cute one. And then this one's so sweet. It's a little cotton tail. Let's see. Oh, 1960. Okay, this is older than me. Yahoo! So see the back? Definitely older. You don't see Sesame Street or anything like that on there. Little cottontail. Look at that cover. Oh my gosh. Cute. So, those are the books I got. That's my thrift store and Dollar Tree haul. All right, you guys. Take care. And I'm going to be back with, T I was going to say TikTok, Timu. All right. See you in a bit. Bye.